got her up and running. Bronco is running. She's loud. I know, she's loud. She's like a straight pipe. But she's running. Had a ground off. Let's see, had a ground off. Uh, I don't know where that even comes from. Oh, that guy grounded off up here. A couple of them, but he probably came in to hear me. Had to ground that guy off up here. There's another one back here. I had the ground off. But she's running. She's alive. She's alive, guys. I got. I have to cough. <coughs> no, she sounds good. Let's see. Yeah. Open the door up here. Come on, door. Okay. I know. There's a lot of stuff in here that needs to be done yet, but come on, baby. ABS lights on. Yeah, who cares? Nope. We got the 1993 Ford Bronco up and running. I didn't know if it would even start, but she did. She's running. She's running good. May have to pull this out, wash her off, and. Uh, Maybe we'll start doing something on this. I don't know. I'm, I'm getting getting more interested in doing something on this. What do you think, guys? Comment down below. This is going to be a really short video. I want to let her run here for just a few minutes. She hasn't been ran in like a year and a half. Doing good. Sounds great. Probably need to let her run for a little bit. Get that oil all going around. I just got it. I got everything piled up in the back here. I never thought she would be mine again, but she is. Uh, what a job to put this thing back together. Got a bucket back here just full of... <laughs> Sounds good, doesn't she? Got a bucket back here. Yeah, it's got the jack in it. And just all full of bolts and screws and stuff. I don't know where they go. We'll figure it out, though. I may get back to work on this thing. Anyway, probably have a video up tomorrow on starting this thing. This is kind of a quick little update. Just, uh, we got her going. Got her going. Gosh, she sounds good. Sounds really good. Windshield trim, I think. I don't know. It's been so long since I've worked on this thing, but. Alright, guys. I'm gonna let her in for a little bit, and uh. It's really hot out right now. I think we have a heat index. About 100 degrees out. It's, it's really warm out. Took the battery out of the 7.3 IDI diesel and brought it down here and charged it up and had the had the charger on it as well. Ah, she sounds good. 
kind of getting me excited. I don't know. Maybe I'll shut her off. Like I said, it's going to be another video on this. Probably tomorrow. I'll, well, I'll probably make it tomorrow. I don't... Thing off. Probably make it tomorrow. I don't know if I'm gonna put it up tomorrow, but what is tomorrow? Saturday? Might put it up Sunday. Maybe we'll start putting this girl back together, get her pulled out of here and wash her off. She's really freaking dirty. I don't know what that no I know what that noise is. It's this guy right here, the battery charger. So, anyway guys, that's what's going on here right now. I got the old Bronco fired up. Sweet corn is finally ready, so I think, uh, well I know, Jody and I are gonna, uh, we're gonna go shuck some corn and make some sweet corn. That is what is for supper tonight. Huh, I'm glad I got that thing started. I, I didn't know where all the grounds were. Had one. Had to ground the solenoid off. Had to ground. There's a couple over here. Those two wires right there. I had to ground up to here on a bolt. There's one back here. He's supposed to be mounted up in there somewhere, but I grounded him off uh, somewhere. And she fired up. I don't know. That battery. I took the battery out of the. 7-3 IDID, so I don't know if she'll fire back up on her own now or not. Nope. Needs a little help. I think those batteries are shot, so I'll probably have to get... Come on, turn off. I can't, I can't get it turned off. Push the key in, turn it off. Alright, probably have to get a couple new batteries for that 7-3. I want to get working on that thing as well, but... Anyway, guys, the Bronco is alive. Probably gonna put out uh, put out a video on that tomorrow. This wasn't much; it was just showing that started. But uh, anyway, I'm gonna walk back over here to the old shop. I'm gonna shut it up, go up to the house with Jody, and uh, shuck sweet corn, and that's what we're having for supper tonight. Sweet corn finally got ready. It was like today, I think. It took a little bit to find it. You're probably picking up some wind noise. It took a little bit to find it. Probably middle of next week. We're gonna we're gonna bag up a whole bunch of corn. Probably a couple hundred bags of it. Freeze it. Nothing like fresh tasting good sweet corn in the winter time. So anyway guys. That's what's going on tonight, and uh, we'll catch you next time. Bye-bye.